up guys, Son of Beast here. We're back for another NBA Playoff Edition of the NBA 2K21. Next game is up. Milwaukee Bucks versus the Brooklyn Nets. As right now, if you guys are enjoying Game 7, guess what happened? The Nets got destroyed in Game 7, and now their season is over. But the only player that, that hasn't got a chance to leave was Joe Harris. Why would Joe Harris have to stay in, in each game? And because and because you know how well he got just played, he could not leave. So I'm looking for the Lakers players, Kyle Kuzma, to be playing with the Nets, and Joe Harris leave with the Los Angeles for with the with LeBron James's team. So we want to see all franchise players on the starting lineups. That could be a good idea to give it a start. Thanks to Blake Griffin, we wanted to see what happens at that point. Plus, no changes for Milwaukee Bucks, only one, it was Eric Bledsoe. And I wouldn't want to see Chris Middleton go, because I don't know what he's going to do next. But for Giannis Antetokounmpo, he's the only captain of the Milwaukee Bucks. We're going to need to try to give him another shot at that point. Association will give, it, will give that one a try. And then I will have I'll have those guys take the icon as well. We'll see how well they can do at that point. Now game two, Brooklyn leads one nothing in a series of 2K21. And here are the categories: best shoes, best 2K shoes, most likely to be worn as the NBA player, the use of a color, and the throwback. So you can definitely take a look which one do you guys would like to see next. Well, take a look at the Shoe Creator Challenge, and who's the best throwback? Okay, let's go. First up, it's best throwback. Out of these four designs, so, who's updated So, let's see which one it is. you like best. And the winner is... And the winner is... Best throwback. Best throwback. It's the Big Apple. That's the shoe creator for the throwback. I really want to win. It's definitely the throwback. You know, when it comes to uniforms or shoes, like it just reminds me of being a kid. And it would mean a lot to have my shoe in the game. Don't worry, I'm just going to do one at each time for each game. So don't comply of which one do I like. And I just, I hope I can win it. Best 2K shoe will be right on its way with you for the next game. Clippers versus the Jazz. Now we welcome to the following presentation of NBA Playoffs. And here we go. We're heading into Brooklyn of the Barclays Center. And, just about to get underway as the and we are just about to be ready. And we get started. And this message. We'll see what happens when there's a challenge. Face of play. And right now, this is another gaming matchup here at another Eastern Conference semifinals before game three. That's at Milwaukee. Here's the Jerome Holiday is in his eighth season with the Pelicans. He said, I've been here the longest with the possible exception of the security guard. There was a ball boy who was here before me, but now he's one of our coaches. Kevin, he's still all in, trying to help the Big Easy get back to the playoffs. Terrific. Big Terrific points. play. Thank you. And they'll have some minutes. And so only Spencer Dinwiddie only has gotten himself injured, so he will not be playing for this season. He will play, unlikely, to play for next season. And if you're ready to be tuned in for Brooklyn next to win, here are the starting lineups. We got a key matchup, Kari Irving versus Dante DiVincenzo. And Giannis on the Kupo against KD on the point four. Blake Griffin against Brooke Lopez, Chris Middleton against Joe Harris, and Drew Holiday against James Harden. The Beard Man. Mike Brunholzer is the head coach for the, uh, for the Milwaukee Bucks. And Steve Dash is the head coach for the Nets. Plus, we got some good excitement here. Let's see who wins the second game jump ball. The tip off, Brooklyn wins it. I know, I don't know why I picked this color, but this is what everyone was thinking about. Why do I need to think about that one? We'll see what happens here. Here we go, Harden. Jumping in is a little too low. 
a little too early at that point. I mean, a little late. You back off of him. Nothing will ever count. Oh, Milwaukee ball. Could have been a good try here for James Harden to pick up a steal. But it wound up being too far back. Finds Giannis. He pushes up Brent Ferry, Greg Anthony, and Kevin Harlan are tonight's commentators. First book will be Giannis Antetokounmpo. Advantages that Giannis has really present a tough challenge for the defense down there. Harden again. Finds Blake Griffin. Go right around, Brooke. Oh, Brooke Lopez picks up a block. Free for DiVincenzo. It's missed out wide. KD with the rebound. It didn't fall off that in time. It may be too tough to hear it. Hey, play. I'm right here. First shot. Irving comes in. Kyrie is not the biggest guy on the floor, but he is built and built to take that kind of contact. And Kevin Durant. Here's another look here for Dante DiVincenzo. Moves over to Holiday, back to DiVincenzo, takes a dunk inside the paint. And now it winds up to be 4-2, and then the lead. With two hands on that stuff. Two hands with that stuff. Could be hard for him to go through. The AD up. Three! Kevin Durant! First three-pointer for Brooklyn. Now here's Chris Middleton. Again, Saris. Oh, coming in the drive. It will be Chris Middleton. He's putting up just a bit better. Five minutes left. Game's on it again. Uh, I don't see anything going on. Blake Griffin over again. Joe Harris comes up with another look at the screen. Up an overpass. Great pass by Blake Griffin. First assist. And first basket for Harris. People open when Blake Griffin has vision on the floor. He exploited the hole in the defense that time. Drew Holiday against Harden. He finds DiVincenzo. Shoots over Irving. And that one falls out as Griffin gets a rebound. And there's Irving. 3 on one opportunity, and it's blocked back. But by the Greek freak. Drew Holiday continuing hustle play. Or Drew Holiday, I don't know. KD for two. And no, oh, it's a three. We could have challenged that play already. Come on, ref. You could have got done better than that. Now here is Holiday. I should have been a two-pointer already. I know they challenged it, but it should have been better. Do it at the right timing. After Jacupo misses the shot. He puts it off the board at that point. Now another hand is Irving. Irving fast to Harris. Dive over to Griffin. Shoots over Brooke. That shot's no good. Dante DiVincenzo with the rebound. Finds Holiday. I didn't see that by Katie. But Antetokounmpo saves it. As he got a rebound and tried to help him out. Now they're down by two. 3.15 left to go. Harden outside for three. Missed out on the wing. Tell he thought that triple was gonna fall. In the corner. Well, nice try, but it didn't wind up anyway. It's Chris Middleton fades it away. First time out. It's on Brooklyn. 301 left. Tied up by 10. Looking well out there on a comfortable run out there. But it looks like Ant Jacupo might be maybe maybe shutting him out and hold the game up with 1-1 one, one on the score. Well, if you call that one on this run, there might be a tough shot for those guys that they can keep it up already on this run. The opportunity of this score is not even defended. And defendable on each run. It may not be enough for them to give it a try, but it's hard for them to give a work to give a uh, we give another shot at the time. When it comes in, the game. That's all that counts. 
Give her a look here for Brooklyn and Milwaukee. Here's another look here. Four players have checked out. Four players have checked in. As you have Fortis, Tucker, Connaughton, and Forbes checked in. Another change here. Five players have checked out. But Irving moves to point guard. Bruce Brown, Jeff Green, Nicholas Claxton, and Shannon. Shannon's trying to go over again. Jeff Green. Shots way off the bars, and now the first rebound on P.J. Tucker. There's a look, and Connaughton slams it down, his first. And now the first look here for Forbes, taking a first assist. Kyrie Irving, stepping up, lays it up, and gets a two-pointer on the board now. Irving's got four points in this game. With around 2.10 remaining, Middleton of Bordas over Claxton, and he gets a rebound. He gets his first one to get a little try. Bruce Brown on the wing, two minutes left. Up again, three-pointer, a little late. 150 left to remain in the first quarter. Tries again. Here is Forbes. Forbes past the middle Bruce Brown is on the point on the D. Try to push right through the paint. Shows up again. And a rebound here for Claxton. Try to help him out. Shannon. Worth the Bruce Brown. And but Irving saves it. Rebound by Green. Shannon outside. Blacks it with the screen, and he gets a pass, gonna go up, ooh, almost had a clock being buzzed out with the shot clock violation, but Nicholas Claxton's got his first bucket inside, little fade out, try not to waste any more of it, Middleton outside for three, it's missed off target, 45 seconds left, green again, Irving outside. It's a three-pointer. Black sandwich to try to go right into the uh, another rebound, but it might be off target. Another three-pointer miss for the Milwaukee. Bruce Brown finds Claxton. 23 seconds left here. Move around the green. Shots good at one. Portis with the foul. Free throw coming up will be Jeff Green. One shot left, Portis first pistol. They'll be shooting their first free throw here in the first quarter, but nothing for the, for the Milwaukee for the first quarter for the free throws. Could be tough for them, but it may not be enough. Shot goes in there. Have a look, Chris Middleton. Looking away to figure out the score here. Ten seconds left to go. Shamit on the cover. Shamit up. But he could not handle it off. It will be Milwaukee ball. And fantastic run. That was Lubro Lopez that turned it out. With a lot of determination out there. Could be a tough one to give it a shot. I don't think there's a, there isn't any choice for him to give it a score. I don't see Giannis out there. Just four Three seconds, seconds left right eight. now. Drew Holiday going deep. Three point range. And it's a ram. That's the end of the first quarter. 17 to 12. So you're in front of the score. Second quarter will be underway shortly when we come back. I'm not going to be in the same sentence, but i got to put the work in. Whenever I face him, i got to show up. I cannot be taking day off against him. Maybe sometimes you can just do it again for the kickoff on the night. But we're going to see what happens at this point. We'll do the Bucks versus the Lakers. It's been a kickoff start here in a season six. We're going to find out if I'm going to do it in this game. But I'll, I'll let you guys, I'll get the schedule here for next season. So stay tuned because I will do it shortly. Here's Green following up with the block on the Brooklyn. Three days. Harden. It's 
first three-pointer. Green is out there. He's got his first block. Trying to do it again. Portis hits the three. And they got it back out there, down by five. 6.13 left to go. Here's Bruce Brown on the uh, corner. Finding over is James Harden. A good pass by Bruce Brown. He will take the first assist. Previous to see in this game, he could be all right to have his face mask. The shield that helps his face. Oh, green two blocks in a row. That's a 2-1, two, two for two for two. And one, KD got a pointer. Connors in with the first foul. Eight points. Let's check in with David Aldridge on the sideline. Hey Kevin. Well, if you just look for a few minutes at Giannis Antetokounmpo on the court, you know why he's called the Greek Freak. It's the drive that makes him an MVP. He said people try to make it complicated. Life is simple. You know what you want? Go get it. Do what it takes every day, and don't lie to yourself. Guys, I hope you understand. I'm more truthful in all of these reports. Back to you. Love the intensity. Love the intensity out there. Thank you, DA. That's good. That's good for KD. Nine points in this game. 5.48 left. 25 to 15 to score. Here's Giannis. Goes right to Connaughton. Connaughton inside the paint. He gets two more dunks at that point. 42% for the Bucks, 53 for the Nets, 5.30 left to go. Harden outside, finding his Brown. Back to Harden. With the step in, a nice Euro step, that goes for Harden. Another two-pointer here. Nope, I don't want to do that. Seven points. I'm believing he's working on his ability. And oh, oh, no! Giannis on the Kupo sending a dunk. Five minutes left. Brooklyn lead by eight. Brooklyn lead by eight. Harden outside. Harden trying to make a step on it. Brown moves to Harris. Finds KD and he dunks it. What a run on Giannis on the Kupo. And Joe Harris got the good, good pass. One shot, one pass timer. Holiday against Harden. Screen ejected. And Drew Holiday gets a layup. Shaking up one for four here in the first half. KD again. He seems to be on the floor. Almost lost that ball, Harden. Oh, Dante DiVincenzo didn't see that coming. And offensive foul is on Bruce Brown with the loose ball. That's going to be his first foul as Connaughton was checked out. Chris Middleton is checked in. And Chris Middleton didn't seemingly really want the other players to get tricked up again. And down to four minutes, on a group of DiVincenzo. DiVincenzo finds Middleton. Goes inside. Missed again, opportunity on a run. Griffin got the ball. 12 for Brooklyn. The rebound, 8 for Milwaukee. Griffin outside, cuts in for Harden, and he dunks it across. Harden still can surprise defenders with that first. The underrated vertical that he possesses. Turned out to be a good game out there. MVB, I don't understand who that, what does that mean. Middleton against Harris. Shoots up, shot's good. Chris Middleton's got his two-pointer again. Timeout call on Brooklyn. Looking the balance of this game, could be very tough for him to give it a shot. But I don't know if we can see it right across from here. There might be a chance for the solution here. You can try to keep an eye on that one. We'll make some few changes on the offensive court, and I will see you guys after this one. So, that'd be a good one. We'll find out. A couple new changes here. Shamit checked in for the Nets. Shamit checked in for Nets. James Harden. 
Now we're changing here. Irving for James Harden. And Irving will step in for the drive. And he's got the lead up for six points. 33 to 23 is his score. Drew Holiday again. Passes to Giannis Antetokounmpo to DiVincenzo. Over to Holiday. Holiday to Antetokounmpo. Trying to force it. And he is right around KD. You don't mess with the Greek freak, Giannis says. Because I am, well, could almost be a technical foul anyway. So don't even try to think about it. Outside Irving. Let's it go. Jam it up. Letting it go with the three is so good as his first three pointer misses. To the middle. Inside. Holiday goes up. Holiday's got his second and he's got a second basket. Such a great build. 205, 210 pounds, a bigger guard. Hard to knock him. Three! Kevin Durant! 14 points for, uh, for KD. Brooklyn extending the lead. Holiday outside. Finds Giannis. Counts out with the layup as the another assist goes out by Drew Holiday. Under two minutes left, 36 to 29. It's a score. Jam it. They're trying to get rid of the screen. Two on one is being breaked out. Not a fast break look here, and he got out of the group and another lock. Yeah, you have so many of those. Lock on player. Just try to pick it up the pace. Irving outside. I'm pretty sure at this point. And all chatting, let's go Nets. Ana Kubo trying to go try to look on that one. KD having a struggle on that run. He's lost his control. A J up. Ana Kubo forcing the attack. And he just picks up by three. Point Nets lead. And he's clearly led the way off his Griffin. Slams it across. Nice play here. Timeout Milwaukee. 105 left to play here in the second quarter. Probably the last season that we are looking at is the Greek week showing him off with the win against the Milwaukee, against the Dallas Mavericks at Dallas. Could be another good momentum here to keep it up. What a play this turned out. And there may not be any solution there might be going for. So we have KD, I'll have his um, play Griffin move over this way. Oh no. Oh well, that was a little shame. And then DeAndre Jordan, I'm going to need to see what he can do. I don't see him playing on this court. Only three, three blocks for Brooklyn, two blocks for the Milwaukee. Only one steal for them. That was it. Some changes for Brooklyn. Some changes for Brooklyn and for Milwaukee Bucks. Here's a new change here. Three players are checked out. Bonds Jacupo moves to the center. As PJ Tucker is checked in with Forbes. Now Bonds Jacupo. Now here's Kubo trying to force a drive out there. Nice team for Blake Griffin. It's Brooklyn ball. Carl just came out of the air and said, okay, we'll get back into it. <laughs> Why are you doing this, Mike Brunholzer? That's not fair. Get a little good play out there, but we'll, uh, we'll get it back better at that point. Three! Curry! Irving! Nine points for Irving. Mills in. Oh, he's like attacking already. He's like saying, I'm coming for you, Gervin. Right now, they're on their feet here. Oh, nope, not that really. Harden going up. Oh, he takes a smack. Giannis gets his first personal foul, second team foul on Milwaukee. And his first trip to the free throw line is James Harden. Try not to smack on Giannis. That's what the clue, that's what the point is for Steve Nash. You cannot smack a Giannis Antetokounmpo and try to make it harder on him. You cannot elbow on somebody else's players. That will also be an offensive foul. Harden makes the first. 
and Harden finished second in MVP voting in 2017, won the MVP in 2018. A multi-talented combo guard who just seems to get better every season. And yes, that's right, Greg Anthony. He was the MVP in 2018 with the Rockets. Part of the NBA Awards. Hopefully and how well can you be can you be a fan of the beard man of James Harden if you really wanted to see him again? Well, this is why everybody was really liking it so far. And KD just really realized himself that i like to be back with James Harden. They beat us back in 2013. But this might be an offensive uh, on the play run if my actually Kubo has shows him up to be drafted in 2013 as well. Irving tried to go up at the rim and he goes right after it. 45 to 35 to score. Last, last change up here, Antetokounmpo. Trying to think about a buzz beater, but he will not do it with the with the buzz. They will end it off with the first half. 45 to 37, 39 is their score for the first half. Seemingly they want the Bucks to go right into the game if they can keep it up and go right into the rim. Right now, six point lead for Brooklyn. So well in this one, just try to give it up. And I'll send you over to David Aldridge to the sideline. David. Kevin, thanks. Chris, how did the team's offensive approach improve in that first half? Hey, Chris, thanks for your time. Back to you, Kevin. Thanks, DA. We'll be right back in Brooklyn at the Barclays Center of the second half. We are underway here after the halftime show. What an incredible first half this turned out as uh, we got a good solution to check out. Giannis Antetokounmpo is just setting out to just try to go with the, with the Greek and put a captain on the board. 18 points and 4 rebounds and 4 going off the rebound. Might be off in transition to go in between tricks. I'm sure he could just try to give it, give it, give it up. But let's see what he can try to do to stick up. Oh, we got a good dunk here. Ante de Cupo slammed it down. Drew Holiday with the assist. 6:45 left. We have already started the second half. And here's Blake Griffin coming in around here. Harris out. Three pointer outside. Wide open look. Missed the outside target. Here's Ante Kubo. He goes right around KD. Four points now. Trying to beat up on KD. 14 points. Irving again. Passes to KD. Almost lost it in time. Harden again. Harris back to Harden. Harden! Oh, oh, oh wow! And Harden is just. And still alive, not just being defeated. He's got 13 points, that's just like a number on his back. 13. 22, Chris Middleton. Against Joe Harris, number 12. Middleton is double. Go over. Giannis, number 34, Holiday. Goes up. Throws off, and it's KD with the rebound. Four rebounds in a row. Three! James! Harry! Perry Irving! He's got three in a row. Kind of like high pitch up with the voice. Looks like a Brooklyn announcer. Steven Chenzo against Harden. Like a hoster, of course. Giannis outside. Oh, he cuts in. Oh, he's like attacking right again. And with that guy, he has 14 points. I mean, 24 points, four in the mid range. Well done. And now the revenge goes on James Harden. You just don't mess up with KD. Harden has got 18 in the game. 10 points up. Now here's Holiday. Try to go right in that side. And Harden just didn't seem to leave that Irving was going to pick up an offensive foul. So timeout will be called on Brooklyn. 
and continue to contribute to this ball club. Timeout call for Nets. That will be a timeout call for the one. 90s, Michael Jordan, he shoot it over the I'll, uh, I'll be right back for just a quick second here. I'm going to uh, change it to Claxton. That's a great question. Yeah. With the way Father Time is treating with LeBron, you, you might have to wait and see because he is still playing at such a high level. But, you know, obviously Giannis has got to be on the short list with the Bucks. I'll stick right with you. I really look at Luka in, in Dallas. I, I just feel like with first off, uh, uh, you know what? There may not be any choice left. <laughs> Just so, I don't know what to say about it, but this could be a hard choice. It's not just a good look already. I'm assuming that there might be a good choice here. Let's see what else. Um, I don't see anything going on. Only one change for Brooklyn. And another change up here for Brooklyn as well. Now Anthony Kubo is checked out. And new player checking back in is Fortis. Now here's Bruce Brown. That is, he's checked in with the other players. Green and Claxton. Garden outside. Try to pick up the run. And Earl Channing, uh, he's fouled. By Devin Chenzo, trying to give up a run. First, personal foul is on Dante Devin Chenzo. Gets a wicky, wickety shot with that fade before the shot clock expired. Now Bruce Brown will have his first trip to the free throw line. That first shot goes in. I think Bruce Brown was firstly got drafted. But if you have checked on the Wikipedia, you must know. Bruce Brown for Brooklyn Nets. And Brown drops, and Brown it. drops it in. He got drafted in 2018 uh, in the second round, and he, um, I think he first played with the Detroit Pistons before he set up to Brooklyn. That might be the only solution here. It's not 2020, so that time that was uh, three seasons ago. No hesitation whatsoever from Brook Lopez at that range. For, uh, for Bruce Brown. And he was played at University of Miami. In Florida. Not sure if he can play college basketball, but he really loves enjoying it too. Brown, I'm sorry. Brown, trying to slam the lid up. Oh, he gets rejected by Portis. And here comes the fast break. Holiday going right around Green. And he Green, oh, and we got a put back here. Portis got it back. Three blocks on Jeff Green, and they're down by two. Green around again, and he just had it all. Green is just dominating on the run. Five points for him. He's got six. Now six on the run. Three ten left. Drew Holiday. Finds Brook Lopez. Portis for three. No three pointer here for Milwaukee. Another change up here as Brooklyn leads by four. On the wing, Harris. Harris finds Brown. Brown with the fade. Goes right to Harden. Harden, another fade. Six to shoot. Fade. Everybody's fading again. Brown. Gets winked, but it's rebounded by Portis. That's his fifth rebound of this game. Middleton drives up to the paint. That's number eight for Drew Holiday. But I don't see Arthur DeCuso getting back in here. Harden outside, bounce pass to Nicholas Claxton. Shoots around. Gets wide off, but it's Brook Lopez calling the first foul and second team foul on Milwaukee. Nicholas Claxton trying to get warmed up again, but trying to go right around him. Could be a tough one. Hey, 
everybody else here for the Milwaukee Bucks are trying to switch up on the defense. So they're trying. Of course, his year um, for Bruce Brown was on August 5th, 1996. And the first one at the line is good. He's right now, he's like, he's 24 years old. He just started playing basketball, and he's, on, he's in the beginning of his career. He could be alright to do it. But for Giannis, that was 2013. So they hit the second one, only one out of two will be Nicholas Claxton. He has three. Has been the one differentiator thus far. Forbes again, covered by Shannon. Back to Holiday. Once two minutes to play in the third quarter. Nice block out there. Green got it all. Oh! Oh no. That didn't work for him for Harden already. He shouldn't be spinning around, huh? Is that right? Tucker. Shots up, a miss. Blacks it with the rebound. Sham it again. Milwaukee Chung by three. Right again. Portis steals it. And that's one on one. Shots good for Drew Holiday. And Sham and pick up his foul from Brooklyn. Now Giannis is on to Kukumbo has checked in. As Portis has checked out. What a great steal this turned out. And a turnover on Brooklyn. And one shot left for Drew Holiday. And Arden has checked out. Irving checked in. Durant and Green to the center. Come on, guys. This is your chance. He didn't tie it up that time, so KB will have to pick it off. Changed around Drew Holiday. One thing that's been a constant is that he's a hard worker. Go back to Brown. Right over is KB. He has been for this ball club. Brown on top. Brown missing the three. Oh, KD would have caught him. They'll call a uh, rebound here. Again, Ochtukubo just landing it twice. Now he's got this team, lead up by one. There's no doubt about the consistency when it comes to scoring the basketball for him tonight. A real nice lift for their offense. Trying to switch it up here. Floppy's move. Finds Brown. Shaman outside. Shaman on the wing. Screen on KD. The kick out to Brown. Down to five on the shot clock. KD going deep. Shots a little wide up. Milwaukee's gone one or two from beyond the arc. One or two beyond the arc. Tucker for another look. And he didn't mix it up. He didn't mix it up a bit to try to make that shot. Sham it. Just short. But it's not quite enough for him to make that, make that point. And Andre DeCoupo goes right around Irving. I like how they got the team leading up by three. No Ten seconds left play. here. Irving trying to figure it out. To sham, it. sham it again. To Irving. Irving tries another one. Three! Curry! Irving! And we are tied up now. 60 to 60. What a close call this turned out, but the sudden death for the fourth quarter could be the only one option left. We'll find out after this one. Stay tuned. Here's a look at the state of, of the system of the game presented by State Farm. Like good neighbor, State Farm is there. Set up this one. What an advantage if you're off guard and make plays so valuable. And that's right. Bruce Brown is not the only guy who you, who you, you used to saw him at that at that point. Well, but before he gets traded off to the Brooklyn Nets, he gets well at that point. Try to give that one a good basketball play of uh, this coach by uh, um, I don't know who's the head coach for the uh, for the Detroit Pistons. But well enough for him. Be, being that said, how well can you do? Rookies always try to give it a shot. It could be the top of the ladder for the rookies. Green. Green. 
Low way off on that target, but slightly early. I think we both six rebounds for tonight. Inside. And oh wow! Onto the Kubo's on fire. Thirty points already. One step past half court. He's too close. Green. Trying to slam it up across. Harris going for the lead. It will not be in time. Duck over the rebound. On to the Kukos, just Serena D. Finding another one. And now Yuk's unsuccessful. He kicks up the Tucker. A good D here for KD. A lot of unsuccessfuls here for Milwaukee Bucks. KD trying to go rolling over. Green trying to look around. Trying to scan the floor again. Uh, KD has the ball. He shoots up, lays it in, ties the game up. 62. Kevin Durant's got 16, but only Andre Dekumpo sent out 30 points. Timeout on Milwaukee. We got a good close-up Amanda matchup here by those two guys. And with only that, this is what everyone was thinking about. How good, how good do you have to do? A lot more to happen, there might be a chance. Also new changes here. I'm going to go ahead and uh, try and have uh, DeAndre Jordan. I'm going to have Blake Griffin move over this way a bit. You know what? Green. Wait, Blake Griffin, I'll keep him there. I'm going to have DeAndre Jordan here. I don't know if this is going to be a right idea, but let's just let's find out what's going to happen. Push the pace. Now let's get to pick and rolls here. So, for the next, so we'll give him another shot. If DeAndre Jordan doesn't work for him, we'll uh, we'll take him out. Checked in for PJ Tucker. A lot of new substitutions here for the Bucks. Uh, Jordan is able to cover up on here on Giannis and one. Here's the A. This is a close game, as you know, but he sounded extremely confident. He told the players, don't let up now, fellas. This is when we make our move, right now. Kevin? Thank you so much, your DA. Giannis Antetokounmpo shooting one free throw at the free throw line. First trip for game two. Irving's got his first foul. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight, and he missed that free throw. It's interesting as Giannis has grown in this league. Anyway, it was like counting at East Game. I think I was in Game Seven for the real part. In the business. Now here was Harris from Team Harden. Three, James Harden. 21 points. Another lead changing here for Brooklyn. Oh, Giannis still keeps it up short. He's like, just, he's like, he's gone hype again. Irving trying to go up with another one. But now Harden is getting covered up. Harris outside. Screen on Jordan. Two on one. Not again with Joe Harris. Could have used the bounce pass. Oh, he gets slapped up. James Harden gets his first foul. All teams of Brooklyn are in trouble. Blake Griffin tells him to just calm it down already. Not get slammed too much twice. Dante DiVincenzo will shoot for the free throw line for two. A little piece of it at that point. This should be a heroin. He did this one a shot. One, two, three, four, five. Throw front for DiVincenzo. No shot that time. He gets another one. Only 434 remaining. I wonder what's going to happen. That's awesome. And he hits two free throws. 
just under two and a half minutes. Hurry again. Trying to fight for it. Oh, he got lucky. Irving's got 16 points, 57 for the Brooklyn Nets, 58 for the Bucks. Close one. Anthony Cooper to DiVincenzo. And he finds no one, and he's fouled by DeAndre Jordan. And Giannis just saying, oh yeah, that's how we do it. Dante DiVincenzo gets the another assist. And their lead is, and their lead team is in the lead by three. But for Giannis Antetokounmpo, one free throw for him. It could be the same thing for real, but let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Oh, uh, that didn't work anyway. So Giannis did. Irving over to Harden. Feeds it to Griffin. over to Green Griffin. Nice ball move by Brooklyn. And nice ball move by Brooklyn. Oh, not a chance for deep three that time. Six on the shot. Harden going right after again. Oh, it's set back. Brooklyn ball still has it. And Giannis on the Kubo got that block. And only last possession was Blake Griffin that turned out as Brook Lopez just definitely got there. The Greek freak was like no out of adoption. Two guys are just going for a block of this pass. Harden in the wing. Shots for Irving. Did not go in time. Cutting in, Antetokounmpo, uh, Lopez, a wide open look, it's good, and he gets it to go, timeout on Brooklyn. They still got time, 3.37 left to go. A lot of playing, playing going on around the action, there might be a lot, a lot of chance out there. No answer here, I'll set up Joleris, uh, Luama Kamarat. I'll give it a try. And then something out, Kyrie Irving, I'll have Brown in. And move over here. And that's it. Whoops, hold on a second. Okay. And now, your new balance player of the game will be on its way shortly. New Balance player of the game will be on its way shortly. When we come back, Griffin, Brown out. It's a three! Bruce Brown's got his first three pointer. And now they're trying by four. And number one, Middleton. Goes right to Antetokounmpo. Over again, and one. Luama Kabarat, his first personal. Fourth team foul on Brooklyn. And those teams are giving foul troubles here. One for Luama Kabarat, one for uh, James Harden, one for Kyrie Irving. I mean, there's too many fouls to give him up already. So, try to always be careful at that time. One shot. One shot left coming up for Giannis. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. They were like drawing more whistles, more whistles out there. I the don't see anything right now. All five players are on the street. Look at this. This could be another opportunity. And this is the another successful alley oop for the Milwaukee Bucks. Yeah, a successful clean play. Passes it to Durant. KD. Three! Curry! Durant! He has 19. You're down by six. And it's stolen away by Durant. And this could be a good one. But the shot will not be broken up. Oh, Dion, I mean, Brooke Lopez. He's like, out of here, Zava. Another look out there. Giannis lost it again. 
And then a two on one. Oh, Lava Kubarat just certainly missed. And there's the pass to Middleton. Here we go again. Here's the Vincenzo. Shot's good. Timeout on Brooklyn. 205 left. And they are, and they are just gotten the beaten up. Trailing by. No, this is about I don't know. I don't know how many how many points have been trailing up already. It's like Kyrie Irving's already done. We're gonna have uh, James Hardy get back in the game. Yeah, coach knows that. Never need to think about that one, but it might be tough for them to give it a shot. Well, that doesn't that didn't work for good. We're gonna transition right down there. There's an offense. Pick and rolls. We need to try to give it up. Uh, let me uh, re let me get some uh, re let me get some refreshing drink for a second. All right. All right, I'm all good. Time for a New Balance player of the game, and right now. This one goes out to another one again. And he's like killer. Drew Holiday. And he's played this entire game on his front foot, Kevin. I mean, yes, of course. Of course I'm serious already. How do you know it was Giannis Antetokounmpo? I thought he was definitely doing it better. Well, best point guard player was just Drew Holiday. I can't tell you which one is which. Right now, a streak. For Brooke Lopez, Katie, yeah, it's turned to... off. Katie! Three's good! 22 points for Kevin Durant! And now a streak is turned off. One more for Drew Holiday. A nice C for James Harden. They're cutting it down. And here's a fast break, but it will be off again. Daryl Chen, let's go next. Mala Kamara, Griffin. Shots goes in! Griffin's got second bucket. And Luella Kamara still just trying to think about it. He can just try to like help him out. Oh, Giannis just goes down the brim. 44 points. 42 in pain. That's a momentum changer right there. James up. Three! Good! James Harden's got his number three pointer on the street. 24. And they're down by one. Middleton trying to look out on that run. Faze shoots off and it's fighting up. Griffin got a rebound. Luala Camara. Harden for the lead. Inky connects. Three. Milwaukee. 54 seconds left. And it looks like the crowd is on their feet in Brooklyn for the part of, part of the Barclays Center. Had a hard matchup turning out to be just one and two. Now I'll be, go ahead and sub out Blake Griffin. I'll have uh, DeAndre Jordan try again. I know he will try to do it another one. But let's see how well could he do to try to stick him up. So both teams have last timeouts. Next shot, next shot will go in. We'll be on timeout on Milwaukee or Brooklyn Nets. Now Jordan tries again. Adionis. And he just goes right around it. That's a foul on Luala Kamara. Wow. And the fans are starting to uh, starting to hate Giannis' team because see how well he does. He goes right in the paint and just like slumped again. I don't think he could ever just talk about it. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. And he just had a terrific. Now Nets are drilling by two. Twenty-seven points for Harden. 
And inside Jordan. Tries the first. And he's fouled by Dante DiVincenzo. His second. Not easy to cover DeAndre Jordan. He's that deep inside. Nearly impossible to stop. Mike Boone knows it just changed. She's trying to check out the game. Watching his uh, finger movement. And tell them one of the guys has to rebound the shots if he missed a second. And then they have to call the timeout just in case. <laughs> I don't know what you're looking at. Well, he made the first. DeAndre Jordan has got his bucket here at the free throw line. He's only got one more left. I don't know if DeAndre Jordan could just try to stick up stick with the uh, Brooklyn Nets at this point. Well, that wasn't good enough. Yeah, he was, he was looking already. He lost that one. And now they are doing this again. Yeah, they joined it past the KD. Martin for the lead. The shot's way late. And now the reach and foul personal is on DeAndre Jordan, the second. Here we go, the one on two opportunity here for Dante DiVincenzo will be on his line to fight for the win. It's the first. And they will put them up by two. They will put them up by two. One shot left. He's he missed the second. And now they call timeout here with 21.5 seconds left to go. There's 21 seconds left in the fourth quarter. 87 to 85. We're just going to uh, go ahead and sub out DeAndre Jordan. They just need a I will have Blake Griffin come back in and have Brett Brown check out and then uh, Kyrie Irving check back in and Luwawa Kamara checked out and Gerald Harris back in. All back for the starting five of this group of the game. So only one point for DeAndre Jordan, that's not fair. But that's all he wrote, seven seconds, this is only the choice to get this one right. Pick and rolls. Let's see what they can do. And now a lot of changes here going back with the starting five. Right now, James Harden trying to look over it again. Harden looking around. Harris faking the lead. Yes! Unbelievable! Another shot goes in there that time. Brooklyn is just back in its spot. In the lead, just 10 seconds. You've never seen that one before, but this is going to be sticky with the man of man. Out of limit. I mean, crash the offensive board, patient on offense. And somebody got to do the play first. We got to do this one again. And that's it. No timeouts on two teams and no changes at that point. Here we go. And Holiday out there and around. Finds Brooke Lopez. Trying to look for it. Can he make the win? No, he does not make it. Brooklyn Nets takes the two wins. 88 to 87. A close game in the second game. And looks like they took two wins in this row with the Hornets in home and away. Now, this is what happened here in the second round, just like they did. A lot of good oftentimes on the roll. A lot of good things to expect. Now it's time to send you over to David Aldridge. Let's court side. David. Thanks very much, Kyrie. Nice win tonight. 
what was your thought process coming into the game? Uh, you know, I was just going out there trying to compete on every play, uh, trying to play as much defense as possible. Uh, you know, sticking to our game plan. We had a game plan going in, we executed. Got it done at both ends of the floor, Kyrie. Thanks very much. Back to you, Kevin. All right, DA, thank you so much for tuning in for the game of the NBA playoffs of Nets vs. Bucks. Right now, two wins for Brooklyn, and right now they will be at Milwaukee to face against, to face against the Bucks again. In this run, in game three and four. And now, who had the best block for the defenseman? Well, let's see. One, nope, nope, not that one. Jeff Green got three blocks. And that was him that turned out to be here. One, two, and then three. How could he do to just try to go right after it? I love the best defenseman play of this guy. He's like doing really well. And, and also, one for, I think, uh, yeah. I don't know what DNP, if DNP means, but <laughs> I'm not sure if he does not remember. And one block for KD. Only one at that point. On the board with I mound. A little bit impressive on this run. And let's see if it is. That was a steal, and there's the block. That's where you can definitely tell of what he has done before. Alright, I'm out of here. Peace out, bitches, for as a while as the NBA playoff dial of 2K Sports. Have a good night in Brooklyn. See you in Game 3 of Bucks vs. Nets. Last game will be the Jazz vs. Clippers. So stay tuned. We'll see you guys next time. Bye. You probably heard how Tony is so famous. In fact, you probably heard how Tony was the greatest. I'm black and proud, honestly, I'm fateless. But y'all whack clown smirk, y'all think I'm faking. But truth be told, y'all turds, y'all just hating. And y'all yearn for rooms is gold in my rankings. All y'all fakest, haters, traitors, y'all are Satan. Y'all keep saying y'all will make it, I'm still waiting.